Uh, this is Leroy. Uh, today I'm going to teach you how to play uh, N64 games on your Windows XP, Vista, or 7 computer. And, uh, first, I'm going to show you what the final project is going to look like. So just sit back and enjoy the drive to put on. I'm using a netbook right now that only has one gig of RAM, so it's really not going to be able to run all this stuff. Alright, first you're going to open up the browser and go down to the first link that's on the bottom now. So on the side of everybody else, All right, and uh, the first link should be emulator-zone.com. And uh, then we're going to go to the bottom. Just download Project 64 of 1.6. Just click on that. Then save it wherever. I recommend saving it to the desktop. I already have mine saved, so yeah. And next, you want to go to your desktop, make a new folder, and name it N64. already have one so I don't need that. And you're gonna put the ROMs in there. And the ROMs we're gonna get you today is uh, Super Smash Bros, the original, and uh, Super Mario 64. Alright, and uh, let's go do this first. Sure. Okay, um, click on the Project 64 under dash 1.6, just double click that. And it'll install like any other Windows application will just keep on clicking next it'll be great to install and everything else it'll take a few minutes okay and now for the ROMs on the second link you should see emuparadise.org slash n64 hundred dash um, you know everything else you can just go down and then just go down and click the direct download right here. Then just click on it. It'll bring you here. Then hit download Super Smash Bros. Shit. Right here. ¿Qué es la vida? You should be Un frenesí. ¿Qué es la vida? Una ilusión. Una sombra. Una ficción. Que toda la vida es sueño. Y los sueños. Okay, then just save that to the N64 folder. Just save. Already have it saved, so I don't have to worry about that. And then now go down to the third link, which is Super Mario 64. And you'll just do the same thing that you just did with Super Smash Bros. Keep scrolling on down. Then you just see the direct links and just click download. 
Super Smash Bros. 64. Go on down on this page and go to the direct download. And uh, I recommend using EMU Paradise for your ROMs because it's a lot easier to go through than ROM Nation because ROM Nation downloads slow. But I'll put a link in there and just save it to the N64 folder where you save Super Smash Bros. 2. Already have it saved. Okay, now. And you open up Project 64 1.6, just click on the program. And this will be blank. Your ROMs will not show up. Okay, now to get your ROMs to show up, go to File, choose ROM Directory, go to wherever you save the uh, games to, which in the video's case it's N64 folder on the desktop and just click OK and then these two games will come up. Now to set your controls go to options, configure controller plugin. Now uh, and then you can just change your controls around however and uh, this does support uh, joysticks of every kind it's not really picky and uh, I use my PS3 controller with this so that should work fine. And uh, forever, which game you want to play, just double click on it, and a screen will pop up, and the game will load. And it should be at 60 frames. <laughs> and uh, if you have any questions, concerns, comments, just leave a comment or message me. And uh, I'll get back to you, whatever, you know. Oh. You got all that shit? Yeah. Uh, uh, I got young money up and I.